happy Fallout Day! Hooray! I've got my Pit Boy edition of Fallout 4, a uh, really limited quantity. I'm sure you already know about it, but let's take a look inside the box to see what it's all about. Nice. Ooh. It's a nice big box. It looks quite cool. Very plasticky, of course. No metal involved. Um, but it has some little latches on here for you to get inside it. Let's not mess around here, guys. Let's just get straight into it. Ooh. Fancy. So we've got... <laughs> See, this is one that Tom won't have. Because, of course, Tom likes steelbooks. But he's not getting Fallout 4. But look at that. Look at that for a steelbook, eh? Yeah, pretty pretty simple, but it's still a steelbook. So that's the game in a steelbook. Underneath the game is a teeny weeny operational instructions manual. It comes with different inserts. And uh, I'm afraid, since I have an iPhone 6 Plus, it, uh, it won't fit. And yes, I'm still questioning why I bought this. So, the phones that it does do, iPhone 4 and 4S, iPhone 5 and 5S, iPhone 6, and more than likely iPhone 6S. Inserting your Galaxy S3, uh, S4, and S5. So, I could just have it as an ornament, really, and just have it on that stand. Bottom, ooh, metal, actual, some metal going over. Bottom, there's a clip, open that up. It'll then open this up for you to slip your arm in. Okay. Oh, no, the whole the whole thing comes off, actually. And then it comes with a little band inside. And it's got foam, a foam insert all the way in the inside of that. So just adjust this. Let me put my arm in. That's some pretty mean, pretty hefty bit of kit on your arm. You know, if you wanted to knock someone out, you'd just be like, boom! Little details and things that you can spin around don't actually do anything. There is not much to it, it's just like a children's toy really. But it's quite cool, it gives you an indication also of what it's like to have one in game. Imagine you're walking around the wasteland, you're like, oh, look at my Pip-Boy, holy crap, I've got lots of plastic on my arm. This is pretty simple stuff. Although I don't know how I'm going to feel about, you know, playing a game with this on my arm. And then just going, you know, tapping on on this when I want to do things. It's quite cool though. I really, really like it, how they, how they made that companion app and how you can just do things seamlessly. Breaks the fourth dimension. That's pretty much it. It was a hundred pounds, I believe. I know, it's really bad me. I, I just can't keep a, a, a hold of my finances. Cost around about a hundred pounds. They don't have any more for sale. Again, much like the Black Ops 3 fridge that I unboxed the other week. They all went as soon as I went online. I was lucky enough to get one. So there's the box. There's the manual. There's the game. And there's the Pit Boy. What I am a bit ashamed about is that this doesn't come with a survival guide that you get with the special edition. This is like the top tier of editions. It should come with the survival guide because that would be really, really fun. Just have a little look through the survival guide whilst you've got the Pit Boy in your arm. A little bit of a shame. I hope you like this unboxing. Let us know by liking it subscribing to us and also putting comments in the video down below here let me know if you want to know anything specific about this device i've already told you a six plus doesn't fit in it which is a real shame but yeah hope you enjoyed it and catch you soon